Hi, I'm Joost and I'm here today with the Uppercut Clay versus the Mad Pomade. Okay, so they both have the cool uppercut design with the little boxes here, but of course it's about what's inside. So let's first look at the clay here. That's a very hard substance. It's quite hard to get out of the tin. And the matte pomade here is more of like a creamy substance that's uh, more wet. So they both have a very matte look, but the hold on this clay is a lot better than that on the cream, the matte pomade. This will give you a slightly wetter look that's perfect for messy hair. And this is perfect to mold your hair in any particular style that you want. Of course, you can do a little messy, but I would recommend the cream for the matte pomade for that. And if you really want to style your hair in a matte, very particular way, then I'd recommend the clay here. Now, the smell is also very different. The clay has a light minty smell that's very fresh. And the matte pomade here has a mocha smell. So it's very outspoken, this one. And I don't think it's for everyone, but I really do like it. The Uppercut Deluxe Matte Pomade, and this really is something different. First, the hold, it has a medium hold, so it keeps my hair up just a little bit, but it's more for like a little bit of a messy look. And then the smell, it smells very much like mocha, like a mocha cake, so that's certainly something different. It has the cool uppercut branding here with the boxers, but of course it's about what's inside. And this is quite a creamy substance. The substance also reminds me of mocha and it smells like mocha, of course. So what I like to do is to rub a little across my hands so it's evenly divided and I don't get any lumps. Then go through my hair. I like my hair a little bit spiky. So this hold isn't the best for my look. It's more for like a messy look with a medium hold or a low hold, but it has no shine at all. So it's very good for those out of bed looks. Now it's a little bit more suited to the longer hair of my son. So I tested it on him as well. I like to push his hair a little to the side to make it just a little bit messy and it doesn't get hard so you can go through it during the day. It's very easily moldable and even if you get a few little lumps it will dry up in your hair making it to have a very matte finish. So I think this one is perfect for those who want something different, a different smell, a very manly mocha smell with a matte finish and a light hold. This clay is really matte, it couldn't be more matte actually. Hi I'm Joost and I'm here today with the Uppercut Deluxe Clay and this one also smells Quite nice. It's a little bit more rugged, more manly than the Uppercut Deluxe Pomade. And I actually think that one smells a little bit better, but this is also very great. Now, this one has two out of 10 on shine and eight out of 10 on hold. So it holds very, very well. It's very sturdy. You can mold it into place any way you want it. So just use a little on top and then a little bit extra on the sides and back. Uh, for my hair and it's perfect for thin hair like I have uh, or a little bit longer like my son's. As you can see and the hold on my hair is pretty strong so this is for like an out of bed look. Now the smell is like a strong manly smell. It's a little bit more manly than like a metro man than you get from the Uppercut Deluxe uh, pomade. That's more like a coconutty vanilla smell and this is more like an earthy smell. And you only need just a little bit to do your hair. I just did my own and my son's. And I think this is perfect to use on your hair if you have thin hair, just to get it to stand up. Or like my son, his hair is a little bit longer and you can really make sure that the hair stays to the side. Now you just need to warm a little in your hand and then rub that all over your hands so you can make sure that there's not a big lump uh, somewhere in your hair. Uh, just at one place. Now you can wash this off pretty easily with any kind of shampoo. So that's quite nice. And because of the smell and the hold, I really recommend this to anyone who wants that matte look.